it's 2021, um, middle of January right now, snowy Anderson, Indiana, and uh, today I'll be hiking the um, Mounds State Park. So I'm going to be doing, um, try to do every trail in, in the park, and um, we will see how that goes. We're going to start here with trail two from the parking lot. It's a uh, Sunday morning and it's snowing, as you can tell. So I didn't think the park would be nearly this busy, but I was in the parking lot for, I don't know, five, between five and 10 minutes and I bet you I saw 12 cars pull in. So, it is pretty though. So this is kind of the end of trail one and I just wanted to point out on this trail they have these signposts. There's 19 and 20 um, <clears throat> that will help you to identify uh, common trees in Indiana or here anyways. So it's called the tree trail. There's a sign here. And then over there at the other part of the start of trail one, there's a sign that say that too. Okay, finally in, reached the end of trail one. All the loop-de-loops and double and back I had to do on it. So I came this way on trail five before. Went this way. So I gotta double this up. Whatever. Cool is that? So they dug out and then piled up around the outside. So that sign there says the campgrounds that way. You can kind of keep going up to the campground and then turn around and double back if you were so inclined or hike through the campground and come out on trail four. Um, I'm not that interested in that connector to the campground. On the map it doesn't even really show it as trail five. Actually it's just unnamed. But. Okay, I'm back on the stairway portion and this little observation deck that's really cool so that road right there is actually trail five and then you can just see the creeks kind of 
winding their way through down here through this little that ravine. And I have to go down, over, and up. So Trail 6, which is what I'm on right now, and runs next to the White River, um, is clearly, it's not difficult terrain, but when it's like wet, it's got that kind of slip, slippery mud on it. Now I'm hiking out to the youth camp area, and then we'll link it back to the regular campground, and then back to trail uh, trail four and five. All right. So we are at the campground. It's the end of trail six, which was a sidewalk for this portion. And just like most of Indiana State Parks, or actually most parks in general that have campgrounds, it's just kind of open. I'm back on trail five. I just wanted to point out the train noise. Hopefully that's coming through on the camera. I'm assuming it is. Um, no clue how often it comes through. I've stayed in several campgrounds near uh, railroad tracks and uh, typically they don't come through at night after like 11 o'clock and then um, they come again at like maybe it's like 5 a.m. or 6 a.m. Okay, I finished the little lollipop on trail 4 back on I believe on trail 5 heading down towards trail 3 and the end of my hike all right, so this is the circle mound here. As you can see, it's like a, a ring and then a mound in the middle. Uh, I just hiked up a little spur from Trail 5 and I'm gonna head back down to that. But I thought I'd show you that. All right, so the parking lots are over there. I think my vehicle is one more lot over. I just hit the kind of end of this trail three spaghetti and heading back out towards trail five. Trail three is like I don't know, four or five loops and every single part of it's trail three. So, And here's another three way intersection with trail three. So three, three, I'm on three. That's three up there on that hill. Oh, I guess I should slow down so you can see the. So, anyways. This is the last loop of three I have to do. Then I have to double back on the section of trail I just turned off of. And then come back and then hit trail five and head back to trail two and then head back out to my car. Ow. Made it all the way. Slip and fall at the end. There. And there we are, we're back to the truck. Nice little mounds park bench there. It's 
just wanted to say it's been a good hike. Thanks for joining me. Except for the slip there at the end as I went down to the water. I uh, didn't have really any problems with footing. Good park and uh, definitely recommend you come check it out. So until next time, I hope you can get out and enjoy a hike of your own. Bye.